YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, it's your main man Dame drops back again with another Super Official. Photo of you kid digging, baby, I know you kid. Hey, listen, man. Yo, your boy just got finished spending $7.48 for this new Italian sub at Arby's. Now look, man. Meatballs look plentiful. I see that sauce on the creep creep. Bread doesn't look like some bread red redemption. Bread look all right. Bread look like it's holding this meatball sub down. Ooh, we got some of that melted cheese all in the spot, making it hot. The first thing I'm gonna say, these some light-skinned meatballs, Arby's. These are some light, what in the heat, what? Ooh! Mm. The roasted garlic marinara is definitely working. I love marinara sauce that's been seasoned up something proper. And bread all ripped up at the bottom. That provolone cheese is a nice mummy wrap with that garlic marinara sauce. Provides a real sensual bite. Hey, yo, Arby's, Psh, get over here. Let me let you guys know something right now. Your new Italian meatball sub, what I'm gonna say is, I like the attempt. I like the attempt because I got a lukewarm sub action. I I wish it was like hot. Uh, it wasn't. It wasn't the hot meatball that, that your boy has grown to love. It was lukewarm action, but it was flavorful. It was truly flavorful. The bread, the bread was a little sus because it busted up at the bottom. I don't know if it was that garlic marinara sauce that had so much smack on it. I don't know if it was that right there, but what I know is when I went go ahead and take that bite, the bite was a ferocious problem. The flavors were revolving inside of my mouth and that provolone cheese was wrapped up properly. It was comforting to the meatball. All I know Arby's is that you, you tried. This was a great attempt at a sub. And right now, I'm gonna have to give you a three and a half for your Italian meatball sub. The flavors are in place. The meatball sub was definitely lacking something. Not too sure exactly what it is, but it was lacking something that I could truly appreciate at the end of the day. And at the end of the day, this is just I. Right, is it one of those, I need to run back up over here now and beat it up again? Nope, not at all. That's why you got that three and a half. Change up the bread game a little bit. You want to make sure your bread can actually hold your meatball action. Smaller meatballs, it probably would have held it with no problem. Larger meatballs, it seems as if your bread is on struggle street trying to hold the meatballs. That could upset anyone that's coming here for lunch. They got on a nice shirt for work. They're going to get sauce all over themselves because it's going to bust out the booty cheek of the bread. You don't want that action. Trust me. You don't want no problems, big fella, with that action right there. It's one of those situations. Don't forget, guys, WWE www.cravecon.com grab your tickets up today we got food and gaming being introduced something heavy this weekend at the galveston convention center check out my video right here about cravecon it's going to answer a lot of your questions if you happen to have any questions about cravecon also we are introducing some heavy gaming with the food food and gaming you can't possibly go wrong because while you're sitting there playing games you got to get your hungry on that's just how it works baby so we got that popping off August 13th, www.cravecon.com. Be sure to check it out, and I'll see you next food review. Just keep in mind, this week's gonna be a little sketchy from your boy, because I'm traveling. I holla. What's going on, foodie fam? It's your main man, Dane Drops, out here at Galveston Island, baby, in Galveston, Texas, doing a major for the Cravecon being held by your main man, Dame Drops, and Ken Domica, KBD Productions TV. It's going down, baby. You see, we play no games. We come out here to Texas, we get it popping. We take the biggest thing that they have, that Galveston Convention Center. We jump up in there, we run up in there. We're over here at the water right now. You see the waters behind me right now, getting real crazy. I can't even swim. I fall up off in those waters, baby. It's going down something proper. All right? That means y'all gonna have to come out and save a brother. www.cravecon.com, right over here at the Galveston Convention Center. It's going down.